periodic table, also known as periodic table of elements, and was invented by Dmitry Mendeleev, is tabular display which are arranged by atomic number, electron configuration, and recurring chemical properties. It has seven rows, called periods, and columns, called groups, which contain elements with similar chemical behaviors. Hello! Now we will discuss the importance and uses of some elements in the periodic table. We will start at the 11th element, sodium. Sodium, it is essential to all living things. It has a symbol of Na, atomic number of 11, and atomic mass of 22.99 gram per mole. In household uses, the most common is sodium chloride, or salt. It is used as a heat exchanger in some nuclear reactors and as a reagent in chemical industry. It is one-third less dense than aluminum. It is useful in aeroplane and car construction, laptops, cameras, and power tool. Also, it ignites easily in air, so it is used in flares and fireworks. In household use, magnesium oxide is used to make heat-resistant bricks for fireplaces. Aluminum. It is used in huge variety of products including cans, foils, kitchen utensils, window frames, beer bags, and aeroplane parts. It is the second most malleable metal and the sixth most ductile. Aluminum is a good electrical conductor and is often used in electrical transmission lines. Silicon, the 14th element, SI with an atomic mass of 28.09 gram per mole, is one of the most useful elements to mankind. These are used to make dynamo and transformer plates. Silicon oil is a lubricant and is added to some cosmetics and hair conditioners. Phosphorus. It is important in the production of steel. Phosphorus is also used in making special glasses and fine chinaware. White phosphorus is used for flares and machine-guided devices. Red ones are in material stock on the side of the matchboxes. So far, the largest use of phosphorus compounds is for fertilizers. Sulfur is used in the vulcanization of black rubber as a fungicide and black can powder. Most sulfur is used in the production of sulfuric acid, which is perhaps the most important chemical manufactured by Western civilizations. Pesticides and herbicides that we use in-house was produced with the use of sulfur. Chlorine. Chlorine kills bacteria. It is a disinfectant. It is used to treat drinking water and swimming pool water. In the industry, it is used in car interiors, electrical wiring insulation, water pipes, and blood bugs. Chlorine gas is very poisonous and was used as a chemical weapon during the First World War. Argon, with a symbol of AR and a mass of 39.95 gram per mole, argon is used when an inert atmosphere is needed. It is used by welders to protect the weld area. It is also used in fluorescent tubes and low-energy light bulbs. Potassium, symbol of K, atomic number of 19, and atomic mass of 39.10 gram per mole. The greatest demand for potassium compound is in fertilizers. Potassium carbonate is also used in the manufacture of glass. Aside from this, it can also be used to make detergents and liquid soap. Calcium, with the symbol of Ca and atomic number of 20. Calcium compounds are widely used. There are vast deposits of limestone used directly as a building stone and indirectly for a cement. Gypsum, or the calcium sulfate, is used by builders as a plaster. Scandium, it is mainly used for research purposes. It is added to mercury vapor lamps to produce a highly efficient light source resembling sunlight. It can also be used in underground pipes to detect leaks. It has a symbol of SC and a mass of 44.96 gram per mole. Titanium. It is a strong steel but much less dense. Power plant condensers use titanium pipes because of the resistance to corrosion. It is also extensively used as a pigment in house paint, artist paint, plastic, and paper. Good job! Join us again on another camera video to learn another set of elements.